Oh, what's hard for me to believe? It's hard for me to believe that I'm 63 years old. I, I don't feel 63. But what really defines old age? I believe it is when a person loses their sense of wonder. May we always become, as it says in the Bible, like a little child. And what does that mean? It means to have a sense of wonder, an absolute bubbling up joy of life. I can remember so clearly one time in the early 90s, I was driving on I-70. I believe it was just past Blue Springs, Missouri. I had my son in the back seat, and all of a sudden he begins to scream. Now this is Jonathan, for those of you that have met him. He begins to scream, Daddy, 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 stop the car. I'm on I-70 going 70 miles an hour, and but it wasn't a fearful voice. It was an excited voice. Well, as soon as I could, I pulled to the side of the road, and I turned around, and I said, What? in the world is the matter and he said daddy look and I'm looking around and I can't see anything and he said daddy don't you see it can't you see it isn't that the most beautiful thing that you have ever seen and I'm looking around and you know what it was it was the gas station about Oh, a mile or so down the road with the huge Union 76 rotating orange ball. And he just thought that was the most beautiful thing in the world. And so we sat there on the side of the road on I-70 with cars zooming past, looking and gazing and seeing the wonder of the Union 76 gas station rotating ball sign. You know, I've thought about that many times. He saw something that I had become blind to. I can remember with both of my children and grandchildren going out into the yard and seeing things normal that I would be blind to, like a leaf or a blade of grass, and how excited they would be seeing this. May we become excited this week of seeing things, perhaps for the first time. I can remember one time when I had a spiritual experience. I I remember what that was like. When I was looking through my eyes, I saw everything with a new wonder, a, a new beauty, a new significance. And Truthfully, it was just normal, ordinary things that I would have been blind to a moment before, but they took on added significance. I pray this week you live in wonder. I pray that you have this sense of being a part immersed in God's wonderful world. For every child... The world is a place filled with wonder. Watching the eyes of children open wide with amazement and seeing their fascination with new sights is an experience of joy for the adult that is with them. Well, you too can have that sense of childlike wonder, of exuberance, of excitement over the wonders of God's world. When you consider the marvels of life that seem impossible but are with God possible, you'll be amazed again. You'll have that sense again. How could such a small wing lift an oversized body of a bumblebee? When they do, You will watch in wonder at something that scientists will say is impossible, and yet there it is in front of your eyes. And how does a delicate plant find 
and then break through a tiny crack of rock or cement. And yet, it does. And you'll look at this with a new sense of wonder, the wonder of a child. God's world is wonderful. And I pray that you have that sense this week. I pray that you'll have a God life this week that finds a way to flourish and to be expressed through you. I pray in awe and wonder you say thank you, God, for your wonderful world that I am a part of.